Buenas, estamos en la segunda parte de nuestra guía de Mass Effect. Estamos todavía en Eden Prime. Vamos a ver al pobre Nihilus como la caga, <ríe> como comete un fail enorme. Saren. Saren, amigo, amigo. ¿Qué pasa, su hermano? <risa> El brazo raro que tiene. Mola, mola muchísimo. The council thought you could use some help on this one. Sí, sí. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. <risa> no lo sabe bien, chulo. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Y como podéis ver, se escucha, bueno, ver, escuchar, se escucha el ruido de un tiro, se la ha cargado. Mira que chula, ¿no? Guarda rápido, siempre voy a ir guardando rápido porque no controlo muy bien con... No controlo muy bien con teclado y ratón. Estamos en manos, amigo. Nadie mueve un músculo hasta que sabemos quién eres. Buen camino, Cole. Te dije que deberíamos estar escondidos. It's okay. We're all on the same side here. We're just farmers. We've been hiding ever since that ship first showed up. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the crash over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that. We survived. If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance. Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only, it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. Oh, I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them that stuff. Make, uh, Jeez, Abla. Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. If there's something you're not telling me. Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. En exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. Ah, mira. You greedy bastard. You weren't running for your life. You were running to check on your merchandise. No, it's not like that. I just, I just knew there were some packages here, something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. I'm only going to ask this once. Think long and hard before you lie to me again. Are you sure all you've got is one lousy pistol? Mátalo. Mátalo, uh, no, mátalo. Wait, I just remembered. I, I just had it in my pocket. Might as well take that too. That's everything, really. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. <laughs> Would you rather be a snitch or a corpse? 
Powell. His name's Powell. I got that up on that. Thieves. That's all I know, really. So let's try to keep things friendly from here on in, okay? I have to go. Good luck. Haha, <laughs> Pringy. Pringy. Habilidad demasiado baja. Boo. Boo, 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 boo. Uh, ese es el pobre Nailu. Pobre Nailu. Pringy Nailu, más bien. Something's moving over behind those crates. Hey. Wait, don't don't shoot. I'm one of you. I'm human. Es un I like the way you hit behind those crates during the fight. Really helped us out. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Me? But but I'm just a dock worker. I don't even have a weapon. My name's Powell. <laughs> so what de... The other one shot him. <laughs> what the hell are you talking de, de about? Atar, there were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. We were told a Prothean beacon was brought to the spaceport. What happened to it? It's over on the other platform, probably where that guy Saren was headed. He hopped on the cargo train right after he killed your friend. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. <laughs> I calls contact here on the docks. For the smuggling ring. I'm mad. What? No! I mean... What does it matter now? <laughs> so I'm a smuggler, who cares? My supervisor's dead, the entire crew's dead. It doesn't matter now, does it? Anything hidden nearby that we could use against the Geth? A shipment of grenades came through last week. Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military <coughs> You greedy <coughs> son of a bitch! We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass, and all you can think about is how you can rip us off? I never thought you'd actually need those grenades. Who'd want to attack Eden Prime? We're just a bunch of farmers. How was I supposed to know? Hand over those grenades. Now. <laughs> They're yours. Take them. My smuggling days are over, I swear. <laughs> Too many people died here for you to start chucking oh, yeah. me around. Okay. Oh, right. my dad? There was something else. Could be worth a fortune. Experimental technology, top of the line. Boo. Take it. I don't need it. I didn't want anyone to get hurt. Really, I'm sorry. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. <laughs> Se habrá cagado encima, posiblemente. Necesito armadura buena. Voy a hacer sonreír en franco. A ver si recupera armadura. Ahora se puede guardar en combate. Lo cual es una pequeña putada. Ya para atrás. 
Vamos a tirar para atrás. A ver, pum, pum, pum. Lo que no me gusta de este juego es la guía de los aliados. Muy tonta. Aquí eh, con el juego tener muchísimo cuidado con los enemigos que lancen bombas y tal, pueden ser letales. la siguiente fase vamos a tener que ir con mucho cuidado porque hay unas, unas bombas puestas hay que desactivarlas en x tiempo creo que eran 5 minutos set the charges destroy the entire colony leave no evidence that we were here Esa es la baliza proteana Cojazos tiene. Ahí están las bombas que hay que desactivar. Creo que eran tres o cuatro. El problema es que hay enemigos por todas partes. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry, we need to find them all and shut them down. Así son cinco, eh, cuatro. de tiempo así que ir con calma no puedo guardar nos curamos Got him, 
Ahora que está la última. Va, ha sido fácil. Bien. <coughs> Vamos a subir los niveles. Voy a poner el equipo. Con esto desactivamos, bueno, activamos las pistolas. Así iremos subiendo. Es esencial eh, tener un arma bien, bien subida. Sobre todo para las cosas estas de puntería y tal. Lo vamos a centrar en lanzamiento y en barrera. Ahora si seguimos fusiles de asalto y armadura de combate. Y con Alenco lo que queráis porque... Bueno, lo que queráis si sí lo vais a usar. Yo no lo voy a usar, en cuanto pueda quitarme de encima a mandar a tomar por culo. A ver, pistolas. Esta es mejor que la que tenemos. Equipada. Vale, ya está. Volvemos a guardar. Hay que cuidado porque hay cascarones. Pueden ser una patada en las pelotas. Por ejemplo, más adelante habrá una zona donde donde nos meteremos en una nave que está llena de cascarones. Esta misión, un cascarón que te, que te pille cuerpo a cuerpo, directamente te puede matar. Tienes muchísimo cuidado con ellos. Vale, todos los bichos muertos, pues antes de ir a por la baliza, coge, cogeremos equipo. Pues este juego, lo, <ríe> mi juego lo vamos a hacer mil veces en, a lo largo de la partida. Adiós. Oh. oh. Uh. Mil veces y a mil veces vamos a odiarlo. Es un coñazo enorme. Pero de experiencia eso nos viene ni que pintaba. A ver, bim, 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 bim. Nunca hay que subestimar esto de experiencia a 10 puntos, experiencia a 10 puntos. Pero vale, solo dan 10 puntos por cada uno, así. Pero al final del juego habremos pirateado 2.000 o 3.000. Y esas experiencias son las burradas. Hablamos de bastantes niveles. Bueno, ya aquí ya solo nos queda ir a la baliza y ver una visión y demás. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It's amazing. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated. Yeah, the manas has to get there first because it's standing by. Oh, brilla. Yeah, I'm liado. Ha ha ha.
Ese salto era completamente innecesario. Va a ir a Valencia a tomar por culo. Muy bien. Muy bien, Ashley. Has triunfado. Ay, estoy dormidito. <risa> papá, papá, se para muerto. No, hijo, está dormido. Ah. We identified the ship that touched Pechaco. down on Eden Prime. The Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Locura. This human must be eliminated. Y se te la oye, no sé de qué hablas. Doctor, Doctor Chakwas, I think he's waking up. ¿Qué ha pasado aquí? Me da la cabeza. You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Like the morning after shore leave. How long was I out? <laughs> About 15 hours. <laughs> Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. Well, I it's my so fault. I, get I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. I expect better of my people, Williams. You endangered our oh, entire hola. mission. Rapa polvazo. Don't be so hard on her, Commander. We have no idea if that's what actually set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. I don't suppose it occurred to you that Eden Prime <laughs> has medical facilities? Listen, you're better off in this infirmary than in any hospital on Eden Prime. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal base waves. I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death? Destruction? Nothing <laughs> Hmm. I better add this to my report. It's <laughs> Oh, get it, I No. How's our exo holding up, Doctor? When all the readings look normal, I'd say the command is going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. I guess I haven't been outside the veil in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. Chief Williams isn't part of the Normandy crew. I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. Hey. Lieutenant Elenco <laughs> agrees with you. <laughs> That's why I get it. But uh. I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Poor Jenkins. You said yeah, you had to see me in the private, head. Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Gether invading. The Council's going to want answers. <laughs> the Council can kiss my ass. <laughs> I won't let Hola. them blame me for losing the beacon. I didn't do anything wrong. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. Saren's a specter, one of the best, a living legend. <coughs> but if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. 
A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. He didn't come to Eden Prime because he hates humans. You're right. Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how. I don't know why. But it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Yeah, a ver, este, digo... Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. <laughs> a vision. A vision of what? Ha vuelto. Creíamos que había muerto, pero ha vuelto. I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. They'll think I'm crazy. We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology, blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction, whatever it was. Saren took it. Qué va, información I, know Saren. Está. I know his reputation is politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. Pues los matamos a todos, a todos. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the Council on our side. <laughs> when have they ever done anything for humanity? If we expose Saren as a traitor, the Council will revoke his status. Sí, vamos a joderle la vida a Saren. The ambassador <laughs> and see if he can get us an audience with the Council. <coughs> He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Wow, 20 puntos de experiencia. Está la conversación y 20 bu, 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 bu. Y no tengo armas ni nada. Me siento desnudo. Ahora que están todos los personajes para ir reclutándolos, no reclutando, no, las, las, para ir hablando con ellos y ya está. Blue, 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 blue. Go speak to Joker when you're ready. Tell him to bring the Norman. El camarote de Anderson pronto será nuestro. Se lo robaremos. En la nave explorarla de vez en cuando porque hay cosas de códice y demás que van saliendo de vez en cuando top ahí yes commander is there something you need how well do you know the lieutenant I'd never worked with him before this mission but he has an impressive service record over a dozen special commendations tends to keep to himself there maybe because of the headaches it's not easy being an L2 L2. What does that have What? to do with it? Well, most biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Sometimes there are complications. Está loco. What kind of complications? Severe mental disabilities, insanity, crippling physical pain. There's a long list of horrific side effects. Caden's lucky. He just gets migraines. Carry on. <laughs> How did you end up serving on an Alliance ship? I enlisted right out of med school. Earth always seemed boring to me, too safe, too secure. I figured the colonies were teeming with hey, exotic yeah. I wanted to travel the stars, tending the wounds of tough soldiers with piercing <laughs> eyes and <laughs> sensitive <laughs> souls. <laughs> Turns out military life isn't quite as romantic as romantic I imagine. Because <laughs> humanity needs the Alliance if we want to keep expanding through the Traverse. And the Alliance always needs good doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. Ever think you made the wrong choice? Sometimes I think about opening a private practice back on Earth. Or maybe taking a position at one of the new med centers out in the colonies. But there's something special about working on soldiers. If I left the Alliance now, well, I feel like I know, was abandoned. Like I should go. Goodbye, Commander. I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. 
When your number comes up, it's over. His did. Oh, what? <laughs> That's grim, Commander. I guess I shouldn't be surprised, though. Not after Torfin. That must have been hell. Arr. Every time you kill, it gets a little easier. With all due respect, I'm glad you're on our side. <laughs> Things were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before. It comes with being a Marine. But to see my whole unit wiped out, and you never get used to seeing dead civilians. But things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up. Dead Marines, dead colonists, and in the end, we still didn't get that beat. <laughs> you saved a lot of lives, Commander. It might be hard to keep that in perspective with what happened to Jenkins. I'm not looking for a shoulder to cry on, Williams. Just stay focused on your job. Understood, sir. <laughs> Patada en la boca a la pobre Ashley. <laughs> Me da que no, no voy a chiscarme la en esta partida. Glad to see you're okay, Commander. Glad to see you're okay, Commander. Vale, no se puede hablar con el boo. A ver, guardado rápido. Por aquí se va abajo. <risa> Malditos ascensores Los vais a acabar odiando un poco Si, sí, porque sustituyen los tiempos de carga Pero igual habría sido hasta mejor ver tiempos de carga Como veis acabamos de descubrir una entrada de códice Hey, explorar todos los mapas que vayáis viendo porque siempre viene bien. Shame about Jenkins, Commander. Sí, vale. Hey, Commander. Looking for some extra supplies before you head out? What have you got? Esta es la tienda de la nave, por así decirlo. It's not standard alliance, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Y en otros otras ciudades y tal, si compramos licencias, este tío venderá mejores cosas. Why should I pay you for my weapons and armor? My stuff doesn't come from the alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's not cheap. Hell, the licenses alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, I'm out of a job. What are licenses? Why do you need them? Manufacturers sell licenses. Each license allows me to buy and sell a certain brand of product. I already have several basic ones. But you'll need to buy more if you want me to bring in different brands. Okay. 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 El ligero humano, no tenemos la pasta. Vendemos todo esto y aún así no vamos a pillar la mierda. Nada. Bu, bu, bu. Vamos para arriba ya. Total, este tío no sé qué mejor equipo vende. O sea, yo más o menos me acuerdo dónde estaba el mejor equipo de juego, así que... Ya os iré diciendo cómo comprarlo. No es muy difícil. Y a la larga el dinero aquí sobra. Ah, tiempo de carga absurdo. <risa> Lo peor de la versión de PC es que además de... El propio ascensor, que es un tiempo de carga, tienes otro más. Una tocada de moral enorme. I'm glad you're okay, Commander. Losing Jenkins was hard enough. Parece que esto no podemos usarlo. 
todavía. Sí. Uh. Quiero ser oficial, quiero ser el oficial. Quiero, quiero, quiero. Good timing, Commander. Man. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Pues muy bien. La Ciudadela es el eje de la galaxia, por así decirlo. Es una ciudad inmensa de, de los proteanos. Y como he dicho, es el centro de comercio de la galaxia. Una linda florecilla. Look at the size of that ship. The Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Wow, well, size is everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower too. Look at that monster! Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side then. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, yeah. Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to Dark 422. Vaya 422 en efecto. Vale, me recuerda este tema a el de la película Troya. No que nadie haga rimas, por favor. This is an outrage. The council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony. The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. You don't get to make demands for the Council, Ambassador. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Seren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Captain Anderson. I see you brought half your crew with you. Just the ground team from Eden Prime. In case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? Sí, they are. Your sí. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. I'm not going to sit on my ass just because the Council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Seren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus <laughs> ended up dead <laughs> and the beacon was destroyed. That's Saren's fault, <laughs> not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you're clear to stay And that's why I hate politicians. Otra vez el reloj. Joder, estoy torpe. A ver, en estos ordenadores hay misiones para más adelante. Este es el mapa. No sirve para mucho, la verdad. Forma de patrulla de la alianza. Con esta ya tenemos la misión para luego cuando salgamos a la galaxia. Earth Clan, you are in the wrong place, I think. Your ambassador is next door in the large office. Chastising remark. Don't be so rude, Dan. At Muy least bien, introduce amigo. yourself. 
I am Din Korlak, Volus Ambassador. Is you seem to have a bit of a chip on your shoulder, Din. You humans are new to the Citadel, and yet the Council has Some granted you great favor. Oh, chastising rebuke, Din. Your species has always been granted many concessions. Bolus territory has expanded tenfold since coming to the city. Well, espero que en el Mass Effect 3 se se va a escuchar un personaje de esa raza. We still have no real say in the decisions that affect Citadel space. What is this place? You are in the embassy for the Volus and the Elcor. Your ambassador is next door. In his own office. In this shared space, I aid my fellow Volus when I'm not being interrupted. Goodbye, Ambassador. Yes, good day, Clan. Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. You seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Alarmed response. You overheard that, did you? This is all going so wrong. It is not the sorry consort's fault. She's the one who started all this. What did this Asari do to get you so upset? I cannot speak more about this problem. It is too sensitive. She has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where can I find this Asari consort? She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day, human. Pues muy bien. Esta no se puede abrir. Bueno, aquí lo vamos a dejar por ahora. Esta es la misión principal. No, la tarea, ¿vale? Como veis, ahora hay una nueva misión secundaria para cuando la vayamos a hacer. Como dice, marcarlo todo leído y guardar partida. Bueno, una nueva mejor. <risa> partida 5. <cinco. risa> Pues bueno, aquí lo dejamos. Como siempre, un placer. Espero que hayáis disfrutado del vídeo. Eh, si queréis dejar alguna preguntita, poned un comentario y nos vemos en el siguiente. Hasta luego.